everyone and welcome to The Simple Sprinkle. I'm Jackie and today I'm gonna test a zero waste, vegan, cruelty free soap. I've been looking around for a zero waste, environmental friendly soap. I came across No Tox Life and I have to say doing my research I like this one the most. There's no animal testing involved, it's 100% vegan, it works in hard water, it is septic safe, it's palm oil free and it's ethically made. It's not a dishwasher soap, it's just, you know, for hand washing. Some other zero waste soaps just didn't have like the vegan aspect of it or maybe weren't that environmental friendly as they claimed. So yeah, this is why I went with this one with a dish soap holder. And even though it says the your waste, um, I wasn't sure how it's gonna be packaged and it has a paper package around it. This is the packaging, I hope you can see. And this is how the soap looks. I ordered it online, it came a little bit cracked, which is whatever. And I have not used it yet, so I thought, well, let's try it together because I have some dishes. Um, there are two ways of using this soap. You can either just wet your brush and then rub it onto the dish block or you can also grate the soap and make a liquid out of it. Simply grate a little bit of the soap and mix it with hot water. Okay, it is a little dark in this corner. I'm sorry about that. Well, I have two plates that are from last night. They're dry, they're nasty. <laughs> So, let's rub it on here. We oh, should maybe shouldn't do that. I think I have enough. <laughs> Trying to wash so you guys can see. <laughs> Has a weird smell to me honest. But that's also because I'm used to something that's not that great for the environment. It's clean, cool. Okay, now I'm gonna grate some off of the soap and we'll see how the liquid is. Okay, so as you saw, I mixed up warm water with the soap. Basically, you put your brush in there and get the product like that onto the brush, which is a little bit more like the conventional way of washing your dishes, having it like in liquid form. We have another. plate that I just wet a little bit and I'm putting it on here. It's kind of weird to hold it up like that but I want you guys to see it. And there you have it. It doesn't feel greasy or anything. It feels nice and clean which is amazing. So yeah as you can see both ways work just fine. It doesn't have this nice soapy smell of like flowers, lemon, whatever it is that you are maybe used to when you are using regular dish soap. If you want to have a little bit of more scent, you just add a little bit of lavender essential oil if you like that smell. That dish soap is smelling like dry, plain soap. One drop of essential oil. It's now smelling like lavender. You know, you have to be careful with essential oils because they are so strong. Let's see, this is from my lunch. Whoops. Anyways, um, smells nice. I'm really, I'm really impressed by how good this worked, especially with the plates that were so dirty. Let's give this a quick conclusion and review. The vegan dish block from non -tox Life is awesome in my opinion. Apparently you can even take stains out of laundry with it. I didn't really have anything stained to try it out. Overall I'm really really happy with it. It's definitely an option for something that is more on the zero waste side, on the environmental friendly side and also on the vegan and cruelty free side. The only downside maybe is that it has its own smell. It is neutral smelling, but it also has a neutral soap smell, if that makes sense. If you know how neutral soap smells, you know what I mean? If you're not used to a soap that is neutral smelling and doesn't have any added smells, you may have to get used to it, but other than that, it's really great. Yeah, I really like it. I'm really happy I bought it and 
and I'm sure I will buy more of it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If so, please leave a like, leave a comment with your opinions. Do you have other zero waste products that you could recommend to me? I'm really looking more into getting more zero waste products incorporated into my life. So I would love your suggestions what other products you like. I'm looking forward to looking more into the zero waste sustainable lifestyle with you guys and taking you on to my journey. Subscribe if you haven't already. Put on the bell so you don't miss any of my videos. See you soon. Bye. Thank you.